So today I'm gonna to show you how to chop an onion into small, tiny little pieces. First, you're gonna insert the knife this way. As you can see, I'm just putting it in like this. So I'm not cutting it all the way through the back. Okay, so I'm gonna cut it right now. And what I'm doing is I'm creating just these little uh, small slices that will be easier to dice up after. I'm also going against the grain, along the grains. Now, all you do is you chop down, and as you can see, it's already small. Dice it. Okay, so today we're making baked turkey meatballs. Preheated in my oven to 350 degrees. I got myself some ground turkey here, and I just diced some onions. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those into the bowl. Some garlic salt, some adobo seasoning, some Italian seasonings, some breadcrumbs, Italian style breadcrumbs. Now I'm also gonna add eggs, and what the eggs do is eggs help bind all of this together and keep the nice little round ball shapes. Once I get my two eggs in, I'm gonna hand mix everything. My hands are clean, by the way. <laughs> and you just get everything and you mush it up and mix it really, really well. Now because I'm making spaghetti and turkey meatballs, I also have my water boiling with some salt in it. Okay, so now I'm ready to roll my balls. And what I've done is I've taken a baking sheet here and I've lined it with some wax paper. And that's the best way to keep your balls from sticking to the pan. Ball, ball size shape. And I'm gonna roll it up. And place it on the pan. It's not a hard thing to do, it's kind of sticky and fun. So I have successfully finished rolling all of my turkey balls and now they are ready to go into the oven. Now earlier I might have mentioned 350 degrees, but if you would like them to be a little bit more crisp and cook a little faster, you can go 375, 400. You just have to watch them and watch your time. Now my turkey meatballs are done and I've brought them out of the oven. They're nice and hot. Right now my noodles are about to come out. I have some pasta sauce that I'm gonna use. Your balls to your pasta and you're all done and ready to eat.